It's been 32 years since a second lady became a first lady. Jill Biden doing what Barbara Bush did back in 1989. Now, in the first winter holiday in the White House, and it comes at a time when the challenges facing this country are more than just beyond monumental. It's all because of the pandemic. So what's it really like? What's the pressure like? Or should I better while finding out today how to try to be kind of a beacon of hope and kindness when there's often a huge short of shortage of all that. Sade is live at the White House with her exclusive interview today. So Sade. Well, yes, Bill and Liz, these are challenging times for our nation. Many Americans are hurting, dealing with soaring inflation, rising gas and food prices, and now Omicron. All of this happening as we enter the holiday season. But Dr. Biden says that her husband will turn things around. Happy holidays to you. Happy holidays to you. It is so festive here. The calendar has turned to Christmas at the White House with dozens of trees, thousands of ornaments, and tens of thousands of lights. But for the second straight year, the holiday comes amid concerns about a rise in coronavirus cases. This is such a, a, a difficult time for, for many Americans. And we now certainly have the emergence of the new variant, Omicron. Why do you think it's important to stick with the holiday traditions and to celebrate? Well, I think people want to have joy, too, because this, like I said, this year has been so tough with the pandemic. And people need to, uh, now more people are vaccinated, more families can get together and have celebrations. And, uh, and I think we just we're, we're sort of craving joy, aren't we? I think so. Yeah. I think everybody misses it. Yeah. Dr. Biden's theme for the holiday decorations, gifts from the heart, was meant to unite Americans. People from all walks of life, um, our essential workers and uh, our nurses and our doctors and our teachers and our policemen and how communities have come together to support one another. But the nation right now is certainly polarized. According to a new Gallup poll, President Biden's approval rating has dropped below 50 percent. Amongst Republicans, it's just 6 percent. And he is losing support among young voters who were crucial in his election. But the first lady insists her husband has done a lot in his first 11 months. I think he's doing a really wonderful job. I mean, look at all that he has accomplished in over just 10 months and um, it's just I think you know getting those kids back to school getting people vaccinated uh, and returning to normal life and I think that's you know he he's experienced I think he's steady and I think he he brings a sense of calm to the nation and Dr. Biden says that she is confident that those poll numbers will turn around once the infrastructure bill is actually implemented. And coming up tonight at 11 o'clock, I'm going to have a complete wrap up of my day with the First Lady here at the White House.